as already mentioned, um, if your child has got a level of additional need, whether that be any kind of sensory or mobility difficulty or along with a mental health issue, all of this support is available to students. We can't um, help students if we don't know what's the matter. So if you know that your child has got an additional need, um, such as the ones listed there, like sensory, mobility or mental health needs or autism, then it's essential that you're contacting the centre now. Um, quite frequently, I will see students that are a year into their course or even a, into their third year, and they're really struggling because they've not accessed this service. So the Accessibility Centre can put exam arrangements in place, they can help with disabled student allowance applications, they can do dyslexia assessments, and they can also help with ADHD assessments and a number of other things. And then they will put specialist support workers in place for you as well, and they can um, obtain software and equipment um, in line with um, the disabled access policies that we have in place. A student can self-refer and obviously any supporting evidence will be required. Um, but, you know, one, the, one of the things that we really find of help is the exam arrangements. So extra time or rest breaks or a quiet area. Once we are back on campus, face to face teaching, if you've got anxiety, the last thing you want to be doing is trying to enter a huge um, environment with lots of people around. So it's just essential that we get this in place. So please do contact um, the accessible team. There's an email address there you can see, which is accessible at le.ac.uk 